good afternoon and welcome back to another video welcome back to my channel the beauty room hello everybody how was your week been how's your weekend been did you have a good time i hope you did blessed and stayed humble enjoyed yourselves enjoyed family time or enjoyed traveling like on a road trip or you went traveling for the week you went somewhere fun and I'm glad you're all back and safe. No hurt or harm or danger toward you and your partner and your family, your children. I really hope you all had a truly blessed, safe, and humbled week and weekend. So today is October 15th, 2023. The time on is 5 10 p.m. here in the beauty room. So I just came from the Dollar Tree a few hours ago, but I had to lay down, take a nap. But yes, I'm about to, um yes, that's what I did today. Just re really chilled out for the day before I go to work tonight. So, yeah, um, I have three bags here from Dollar Tree. So, I want to show you what we saw at Dollar Tree and what we oh, and what I bought at Dollar Tree. So, welcome, welcome back to another video. And today is Sunday. Today is Blessed Sunday here in the beauty room. Let's get started. But before we do, Make sure yourself grab yourself a snack, something to drink of your choice, and take notes if you like. So the next time you go to your Dollar Tree in store, you know what to buy for yourself, for your family, for your for your children, or for you, or for just your home, or for your office, you know, or your craft room, for anything that you have extra in another room or a guest room, you know, for you and your family visiting and your in-laws visiting, you know, coming soon, you know. Yeah, so what you are plan plan for Halloween, what you are going to be doing, I'll be working. So, <laughs> yes, but I do next month have some some days off, you know, before Thanksgiving and like after Thanksgiving. So, yeah, so I'm truly blessed and grateful to be still working. Um, I'm so honored and blessed to have this job, you know, that I, that I have. I'm blessed with every little thing that God given me has given me in an extended uh, family in law and wonderful wonderful soon to be husband i'm blessed to be grateful to have him in my life i love him so 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 much but if you if you knew ever seen my face before um my name is adon from the beauty room yeah and my videos are all about like um like hauls, beauty hauls, um, home decor, not decor, but just, you know, showing you, you know, what I'm um, about to be building in our home, things like that, and just getting ourselves ready for the end of this year. We got a few months, a few more months left of 2023. I want to do a video <clears throat> this year of, of a girl talk, you know. To see what you all have planned for 2024. Um, I want to do like a Q&A. So that will be coming up soon in a future video. But that will be at the end of this year for 2023. I would like to do a, a Q&A. So keep that in mind. Keep your questions in mind. Write them down. Whatever questions you have for me. Or whichever. I will try my best to answer each and every comment. And if you want to leave a comment. That's fine. Please leave. Please leave a comment. After every video you saw, please share this video with your family and friends and anybody else who wants to consider being um, subscribed to the beauty room. Let them know and I'll be so grateful and blessed and thank you all so much for who you are and what you are in, my, in the beauty room. Thank you so much and if you already just uh, subscribed to the beauty room. Thank you so, so much. You all are <clears throat> truly wonderful people. I'm always praying for you all day and night before I lay my head down. And, you know, and after I come home from work a few hours later, I'm praying for you all, your family, yourselves. Just thank you all so much. And um, just thank you. And so welcome to the beauty room. Thank you. You are part of a wonderful family over here in the beauty room. And yeah, let's get started. Okay, so um, the stuff that I'm gonna pull out in each bag, they're not gonna be specifically in order. So, 
definitely check out Sharpie Pants at Dollar Tree for just and everything is a dollar twenty-five that I bought. I didn't buy anything over a dollar twenty-five, you know, this time. But you know, we'll I'll see what I can do next week or whichever store you want me to go to shop at and let me know, okay? Because there are some places I can't record, so I'll just do a haul when I get home from that store, okay? Just to let you know. Um, this is a uh, or yeah, this is a Sharpie pen from Dollar Tree, and it's a dollar twenty-five. And everything I bought is a dollar twenty-five, so I want to let you know that now. So yeah, this is just a purple Sharpie marker. You know, nothing too exciting. Is it's in purple? Cause I don't have one in purple, believe it or not. And I bought this here um, for like my seasonings when I do like a tablespoon or two. Or for anything like that so that's what I bought this for and this brand is cooking concepts from that brand very cool so this is for like seasonings when I do a video for my cooking video my, my cooking channel I'm sorry my cooking channel called Donnie's kitchen so yep I got that and I also got this movie it looks pretty cool different you know oh, it's called circle circle no noel feel the magic so it's kind of cool so got that and i got i saw these when i walked in the door you know how they have stuff like right there on their t on that white table um so like sometimes behind it on the shelf so around the corner from it and this is called Genomi or something like that. Um, sweet Genomi, like with the nose. Am I saying the nose right? Am I saying the nose right? I hope I'm saying it right. It's cool. Super cool. And this is for Thanksgiving month, so I got two of a muffin, oven muffins. I mean, oven mitts. I'm sorry. Oh yeah, yeah. And then. I got this one. I wanted this since a couple years ago, but I never bought it. And this is just the dish drying mat. And I have oven mitts and oven uh, pots like this color. And like this design. I'm sorry, not this color, but this design. So I wanted to match my oven mitts, what I got with this. And to match those, um, those oven mitts, I got these to match them. So you get two of them. So for dollar twenty-five, I think that is a steal because if you go to any other store, you're paying more than a dollar twenty-five for just one, and you got to get the the other matching set, you know. So, which is not bad at all. So definitely check out your local Dollar Tree inside stores. Um, hope hope there's one near your area, in your local area in your city and state where you live at. That bag is trash. And we're going to move on to the next bag. And we want to what's in here. So, all right. So, what I got in this bag here, hope I'm not making too much noise. I'm trying not to. Okay. So, I just got. Okay, I just got some awesome bleach at like the you know for the um for this price, very good because I needed some bleach anyway. Because we're about to go do some laundry at the laundry mat. Yep, very soon. I needed that. I should. I, I'm gonna go back and get another one of these. Like probably two more for a dollar twenty-five. It's like three dollars and like fifty cents. But you know me, I rounded up to three dollars and seventy-five cents. So yeah, I got that. And then, for Christmas time, I got the hand soap. And it says Mary Berry Soap with the Snowman. Super cute. So, definitely check out your your Dollar Tree when you go into, like, the, uh, what is it, like, the this, not, uh, clean, or cleaning supply, you know, area or department in Dollar Tree. So, and this is the soap. So, this will be for Christmas. This will be... It'll be put into our kitchen um, counter sink. 
So, you know, because we already have something like this for our bathroom. So, yep, so that's that bag. And last bag, I'll leave this bag like this so I can just take out the items. So, but Hamilton wanted this because he wanted the snowman. Let it snow. Super cool because see, we have like a hook into his area to the to his uh, man cave area where he has a hook and he hooks up like these type of things. And it has this twine right here, we can hook it up to the hook, or if you have like a wall hook, that'll be cool too. So, this is just what it is a cool looking snowman. So, he wanted that. So, I gotta give him this. So he can hang it up. Not right now, you know, but in December is when I do like decoration and I do it for Thanksgiving, Halloween, a little bit, but not too much, you know, for Halloween, you know. <clears throat> and are you all going to any Halloween party for the adults and kids? Are you going to have your own Halloween party at home? Are you going to go trick or treating with your little sister, or little brother, you know? Are you going with some of our friends to a party? But just be safe and be careful, though. That's if, if, that's if your parents let you go, though, you know. And then I got these gloves for work. So, yep, these are just gloves for just, um, for just my job because it keeps my hands warm. So, I'm going to wear those tonight. And instead of me getting, like, a real big plastic container of lemon juice, I got this at Dollar Tree and I need this because I'm gonna be making some um, some baking you know on my channel Daddy's kitchen so definitely don't forget to check that out too also as well after you leave this this video and channel and then I got the black pepper grinder so I don't need just like a little container of it I don't need them too big you know too fancy and then I needed some chopped chives so when I do make my mashed potatoes or my cheesy potatoes, I can put this on top of it and let it, you know, um, let it bake after the oven, after I bake it after the oven. So that's what I do with my cheesy potatoes because I do, like, I kind of sometimes do my potatoes kind of thin, like chip thin, chip, chip thin, but not too much, but like medium size, you know, slice them about like that size, about medium, something like about my finger. Um, I put, I, I use that, and then I, you know, what I do, I put, like, water on them so they won't turn brown. Put them in a large bowl. And then after that, then I get a deep dish baking dish, a glass deep baking dish, about, like, a 13 by 9 or 9 by, or by 9 by 13. But the deep dish pan has to be really deep that big because, you know, you got sour cream you got to put in there. You know, you got your cheese, you know, your bacon. So, that's what I do is I make about half of the pack of bacon. I slice the bacon package in half and I cook all of that. I cook it and then I let it cool down after it gets done cooking. Put it on a plate with a few paper towels on the plate. And then when it's cooled down, chop up my bacon. But I take, I remove the paper towel sheets from my plate and then I chop up. Or I put it on my cutting board, you know. Um, I do that for my bacon cut that in like in chunks. I set that aside and then I grab, you know, my block of cheese. You can you can do Kobe come come sorry sorry Kobe Jack cheese. Um, grade that up and do uh, do like mozzarella or gouda or whatever cheese that you like to you know to use for you and your family family table do that but make sure it's black cheese that way you know it's freshly grated but it's totally up to you your preference your kitchen your way you can definitely buy the bag of shredded cheese also as well it won't hurt it as well and then you know each layer it you know spray your baking dish first before you put all the kind of you know the stuff on it because your potatoes will bake in the oven so you don't need a you know pre uh, you don't need to bake them on top of the stove, but bake them in the oven and set that for like 375 to 400. It depends on your oven, but for my oven, I had to put it on 350 because this oven, that thing, that oven is like magical. It's like magic, I'm telling you. It cooks so nice and smooth. It just makes the food <laughs> it just look so good. And then I just take uh, 
on top of these when it's done baking i put this on top of it and let it go on 350 to 375 for a good check it for like the check it for first but like for the whole th um 20 minutes first see how it's looking see how it's baking see how the cheese on each layer like a three layer you know so you want to do your potatoes spray we you know what pam spray into the pan do one layer of the of the of of the potatoes sliced potatoes then do your sour cream then do your bacon and cheese you know don't do these yet just do it on top you know after it's done or you can do it um, before you put it in the oven so either way you know turns out amazing anyway so then you do that keep going so you're done with the third layer of cheese then sprinkle on this here the onion the chopped chives put that right on top and you're done and then i mean that could be a side dish too if you're tired of making like mac and cheese every single year like me <laughs> so i might just do that do the cheesy potato you know with the bacon in between because that's what hamilton's favorite is anyway so it's that <clears throat> but i didn't mean to get off subject but i just want to let you know a little sneak peek of what i'm cooking for thanksgiving this year and yeah and so we got this for our for our marshmallow got this for a baby and and I, I always always tend to buy these because these are very good to have now these are good too for your seasoning that way you know like a tablespoon of cayenne pepper tablespoon of paprika or smoked paprika smoked paprika um like the hot one the smoke one the smoke paprika or you can do just the regular one and if you're not like you know into like spices that much or whichever you know you can use your taco seasoning and put some paprika and cayenne pepper in your taco seasoning as in here just mix it all up put it on your put it on your taco meat you know your ground beef you got tacos so that is it at the end of the video Oh, I'll be right back. I have to show you all a picture of what I did last weekend for Hamilton Night Dinner Date. I'll be right back. Hold on. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. Um, I want to show you all something. If I could find, I think I can. And see, that's the that's the rice on the white rice. And then that is the gumbo. I made that um last week. Thomas and I, we had gumbo. But don't it look good though? With shrimp chicken shredded chicken some sausage oh some celery onions in there green bell pepper oh my goodness let me show you a little more closer up so you can really see it there you go yep it was very good and i want to show you all my cat my marshmallow there's our baby <laughs> she a little sticky butt but that's our baby. 
Let me show you a better picture of her. She was asleep. <laughs> she sleeps so weird. See? <laughs> so you can see that a little better. Hope you can. So you can see another picture of her. And then, um, let's see. Oh, let me see a little better picture, better, better picture of her. So please do not mind this mess. <laughs> so there you go. You can see her a little more better. That's her baby. So yeah, that's our baby. That's our marshmallow. Um, but yeah, but this is the end of the video. I hope you all enjoyed it. Like the things that I got from Dollar Tree earlier today, just uh, this morning is where we went to this morning after nine o'clock in the morning. So. Yes, I'm getting ready to take a nap because I had to be at work. Um, I had to be, I'd be up about quarter to nine tonight. So, yeah, so I need just a few hours of sleep, take a little snooze. And yes, I'll see you all in the next video. But before, before I do, let's say a quick prayer. Oh, Heavenly Father, Lord Jesus, we thank you for another day, allowing us to see it, be able to see our, our significant other, our loved one, our partner, our best friend. Um, we just thank you for for that. And we thank you for our children, oh God. Let us see our children each and every day. Thank you for letting us see our, our families on both sides and to seeing our in-laws on both sides. God, we just thank you for every little thing that you're giving us here in life, God. We just thank you for who you are, for always protecting us, loving us, and accepting us for who we are, oh Father God. We just thank you, Lord Jesus. We love you for, for just accepting us. And always protecting us and loving us no matter what, oh, Father God. God, we just thank you, Lord Jesus. I ask you to continue to bless us all during tonight and all this week and this weekend, each and every day. Let us have a blessed, safe, stay humbled week and weekend. Let no hurt or harm or danger become on us. God, I ask you to continue to bless my subscribers and the Beauty Room family and new Beauty Room family subscribers. God, just bless them. Bless them in their home. Protect them, oh, Father God. Protect their children. Protect their selves. Protect their, their partners, oh, Father God. Protect their home as they're inside their home and outside their home. Traveling on road trips. God, just bless them all the days of the week as they're at work the parents and bless the children that are in school oh father god or even in homeschooling bless them and continue to protect them oh father god at all times lord jesus protect all schools of all grades from k to 12 to to college community college universities top universities oh father god that our children go away from far away from home as you continue to bless them and protect them bless the the, the principals the the, the the teachers, the, the the professors, the buildings. Oh, Father God, that each and every staff get to work from home, safe and sound, no hurt or harm or danger. Bless the children at all times. Oh, Father God, in Jesus' name, we ask and pray. Continue to bless the Martindale home, protect them, bless, protect, bless, protect our neighbors, and bless all of my subscribers, neighbors, and neighborhood also as well. Father God, bless us for the end of this year, two thousand twenty-three, and let us. Have a blessed and safe new year for 2024. In Jesus' name, amen. So I hope you said that prayer with, with me. And just being thankful for the little things that you have. And be blessed for the big things that you're going, that you're going to have and receive and be blessed with. Because I am. I truly am blessed and grateful for the big things that are coming to to me. Um, I'm so grateful and blessed for each and every one of you all. <sighs> Just thank you for making my dreams and goals come true because <clears throat> I really want to stop working and really put my heart and more soul, my heart and more soul into making my dreams come true, my goals and blessings to come true with my YouTube channel. And I thank you all so much for letting it come true because, oh my gosh, I'm just truly blessed and grateful because without you all, this channel would not be possible. So thank you, you all are such wonderful people someday one day we'll meet each other have a meet and greet a company or business to get in contact with me i'll be so blessed and honored because i'll be up there with other top youtubers you know that are truly blessed and grateful and showing their talents on their channels and i'm truly grateful and blessed to be seeing them and what they're doing on their channels which i'm so grateful and blessed to see you know they're doing their thing that's such a blessing that you can so 
If I can do it in a dream, so can you. So don't give up on your dreams and goals. Let your children see the compliments, uh, compliments that you're doing and showing them that any age, it does not matter your age, it does not matter your color, height, sex, or religion. You can do it. The only the person that's stopping you is yourself. Is yourself. So you keep on keeping on. Don't give up because I know it's going to be hard in the beginning. <laughs> in the middle because it was for me. It was really hard. I, a few times I wanted to give up. I said, nope. Nope. I'm not going to give up on my channel. I'm not going to give up on the video room. I'm not going to give up. I'm not going to give up on Ice Kitchen. I want to stay mind ready focus for better for for better for bigger and better things for me and many other people because i want to share the things that i've been through you know with youtube trying to make it in just you know just having fun with youtube you know um other things will come with youtube so never be afraid of showing your face or whichever or your talents or your passion that you have even if it's not on youtube or if it's just on Instagram or TikTok or whichever, you know, or if it is on YouTube, go for it. Go for it because you may never know because God will shine his light through you and through your channel. And, you know, you got to just take one day at a time. Take one day at a time. Continue with content. Continue with content. Continue to do what videos you have a passion for, what you want to show on your channel. And I'm telling you, your channel will grow. You get the subscribers. You get the views. Trust me. It's going to take some time, but you, but you will get there. Don't give up. Don't give up. It could be open up your own cake business, cupcake business, or um, building your own um, insurance company. You know, uh, it could be anything. It could be going back to school to get your, your associate's degree, your bachelor's degree, or your nursing degree, or your teaching degree. That's a blessing. That is an accomplishment. For you, for your heart, for your family, for your children, you know, any anything's possible. Anything, yes, anything is possible. So if I could do it, so can you. Okay, keep keep that in mind. Keep that keep that focus for you. Keep that mentality focused on what you want to do because you know your doors will be open for you at in due time. Trust me, I know. I'm still waiting, but you know what? I'm having patience. Patience is a virtue. Trust me, it is. And today is Sunday. Um, and my fiance, we're watching the we're watching the football game today. So, yeah. So we're just enjoying the rest of our Sunday before I got to go to work. But I just want to tell you that to don't to never give up. Keep going with your left to your right, straight forward. Don't go side. Don't go left because, mm mm. Stay focused. Keep going straight. Keep going straight forward to your dreams and goals. And trust me, you, you'll be blessed and grateful that you did that, you know, because it's, it's, it's for you. It's for your happiness. It's for your dreams and goals. And whatever it is, your next dreams and goals, let it be because it will come, you know. So God bless you all. Enjoy the rest of the week. Stay safe. Stay humble. Stay encouraged. Dream big through the sky and never give up. Never give up on your dreams and goals. Let them stay positive, you know, for you and yourself, for your family, for your children, for your grandparents, you know, <clears throat> or for whoever who encourage you to never give up. Do it, do it for them too as well, okay? Do it for them too because, you know, they'll be happy no matter what, you know, that you accomplish or do. So I will see you all in the next video. Enjoy the rest of your day, week. Be blessed. Stay safe. Stay humble, <laughs> patience is a virtue, and God bless you all. And I see you next video. Bye. Thanks for watching. Thank you for spending your time with me, taking yourselves out of your busy schedule to watch me. I truly each and every video. I appreciate each and every one of you. I say it all the time. I'm so blessed and grateful and honored to have you all watching me for just a few minutes. Thank you all so much for who you all are. Thank you. For just seeing me for who I am and spending your time with me. I appreciate that from the bottom of my heart to yours. I love you all through the moon and back. See you next video. Bye. Bye.